the missionaries came to our church and told us their story. I was praying at our house after this sermon from the missionaries. I'm like, who even knows where I am? How could I ever be called to be a missionary? But God comforted me with the thought that he knew where I was. If he wanted me to be a missionary, he could call me. So one day we got an email we were interested in being a missionary. So we knew that was God's calling. He opened the door for us to come. It's, it's been a really good experience to be able to help people. We live in the lowlands, but the primary focus is to reach the indigenous people here that live in the mountains. So they, they bring a lot of patience to us. It's really rewarding to be able to help people like that when when they don't know where else to turn to for help well it's really the love of jesus for us that he died for us to give us hope in a future and that's what i want my life to be in service to him return that love to him so that other people can be in heaven too one of my favorite things is to see the patience that I have responding to God and I mean that's what it's all about to help people and then they they see that you care for them and they they want you know your religion they want to, to know God too of course we have schools and clinic as kind of institutions to help people and meet people's needs and ultimately you know the church it's the body of Christ um, that that God Jesus organized for service here so it's also to, to plant churches that are able to care and love the people around them to multiply churches church planting movements so that the message of Jesus can spread further out in the mountains <laughs>